It started here in 2016 outside Gibson's Bakery in Oberlin. Protesters calling for justice after an employee accused a black student of shoplifting wine inside the store. Claims of racial profiling and boycotts followed for weeks. The lawsuit filed by Gibson's accused the college of supporting the protesters' views. A jury agreed, awarding Gibson's $25 million in damages. Owner Lorna Gibson says the turmoil ruined the family name. We lost so much of the business um, after the um, protests that uh, we weren't getting the business, and so I couldn't afford to keep the shelves filled. Eventually, the three students involved pleaded guilty to misdemeanors, saying in court the employee didn't act out of racism. A lawyer for Gibson says they're still waiting for the school to take responsibility. It was Oberlin College that could never admit that what they did was wrong. In a statement, the college said in part, we are disappointed by the court's decision. However, this does not diminish our respect for the law and the integrity of our legal system. This matter has been painful for everyone. We hope that the end of the litigation will begin the healing of our entire community. Meanwhile, Gibson says it looks forward to moving past this, serving customers for the last 138 years. Its doors, they say, are open to everyone. Here we've always treated everybody properly, and uh, that's all we just wanted. That's all we wanted from the start, just to continue on our lives and keep the store going. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.